morning and welcome to Money's World of Weather. Your quick thoughts and longer range weather forecast session for April 19th to May 1st. For the period April 19th to the 23rd, we're expecting a trough with below normal heights here over the Bering Sea in Alaska, the Aleutians, and below normal heights here. We have a closed low or trough here in the southwest with above normal heights here and here. Models are pretty good in this um, setup. We're going to go to the end of the period, which is the, the third, May the 23rd. We don't see very little change, maybe a week of higher anomalies. That's about it. The flow is split here across the western U.S. come together with a zonal flow in the east. Unsettled weather is forecast for the east central states late in the weekend and early next week. Temperature anomalies during this forecast period are forecast to be about 10 to 20 degrees above normal in the west and about 10 to 20 degrees below normal in parts of the plains in the southwest. We're going to look now at the period for April 22nd to the 26th. We're here for the 23rd. Still we see a split flow here in the west to the northern streams and the southern streams. And we still have uh, below normal heights in the southwest, southern Rockies, above normal heights here, weaker height anomalies across the um, eastern U.S. And we still have our trough here over the Bering Sea, an upper low here over the Bering Sea. And then we're going to go to the end of the period, go to the 26th. And now this is GFS. It forecasts us the elongated uh, area of below normal heights for this region the upper low here in the Hudson Bay. And when we look at the other models, still little overall change. Some of them have a trough further to the west. But all in all, the same pretty much pattern. Uh, the ensembles during this forecast period are forecasting above normal temperature to the west with anomalies of about 5 to 15 degrees above normal. Dew pocket to 20 degrees above normal here and temperatures close to the east will be about 5 to 15 degrees below normal. So for this forecast period I'm forecasting above normal temperatures here below normal temperatures for this region and for precipitation forecasting above normal precipitation here and here below normal precipitation for this area and this would be good news for the drought areas of, the, of California. Okay, now we're going to look at the period for April 27th to May 1st. Here we are at the 27th. Most of the models are forecasting here um, below normal heights across much of the nation, above normal heights here. And we have our upper low still near um, Hudson Bay. Zonal flow across the east, still a split flow. We have an upper low here. And uh, we go to near the end of the period. This is the 29th. And we see very little change in the pattern. We go through the models. Perhaps um, the Canadian ensembles are a little weaker with the below normal heights. Temperature anomalies during this forecast period are forecast to be about 5 to 15 degrees below normal in the east, and temperatures will be about 5 to 15 degrees below above normal in the west. So we're forecasting this temperature anomaly, forecasting above normal temperatures here, below normal temperatures for this region, and for precipitation. We're forecasting above normal precipita above precipitation here, which this is a good sign. The models are consistent, still forecast above normal precipitation for California, and we have above normal precipitation here. So that is the long range weather forecast discussion for April 19th to May 1st. Thanks for coming to Jim Munley's World of Weather, and have a good day.